I need more clothing? No. Did I buy more clothing? Yes. Yes, I did. <laughs> hey guys, welcome or welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Michelle and today I have a summer clothing haul for you guys. Uh, I've been to Primark and then also I have a couple things from like the thrift store and H&M I think. Yeah, two things from H&M that I want to show and a pair of shoes that I got. And I just thought I'd show you guys everything that I got because why not? Alright, let's start with the pair of shoes because I'm so, so excited about those. Also, this is the first sit down video I'm filming with my new camera. So we're going to see how it does. Uh, but I got these. These are by Koi Footwear. And they are the Estra boot, boots, so they have a little sun, a moon, and some stars, there we go, um, on both sides. They're soft velvet, and they have a platform. I'm so happy with these. These were 60 euros, I think, um, and I've been wearing them to school a few times. And they are so comfortable. It's insane. It feels like I don't have any shoes on. Which I do. But they're just very comfortable. Alright, let's start with the Primark stuff. Get that out of the way. First thing that I got. Not a clothing item. But it's this bikini bag. I thought this would be very handy if I go swimming. Or like swimming. And my bikini is wet. I can just pop it in here. So my bag doesn't get all wet and this was only two euros so i was like why not it's a very cute tie-dye print i love it next up i got some cycle shorts actually uh, i got two pairs of black ones and then a gray one in case i wear a light color dress i love wearing these under dresses um it just makes me feel a little bit more secure that's the first thing. Also, it helps with the top rub. Um, and these were three euros a piece. I've never seen them before at my Primark. They're always sold out. So I was very happy to finally be able to pick some up and start wearing those under my dresses. So I can keep my workout shorts for working out. Because now I wear those underneath. And that's not, not ideal. Next up, I got a belt. I wanted a new simple black belt and this has a little little detail on it that I thought was very cute. Just a simple black belt. Um, I can put my camera back on this if I want or just around a dress or something. Four euros. I got, I folded it very weirdly. Okay, I got this shirt. This is from the men's section, but I couldn't care less, honestly. It's this blue tie-dye shirt. It has the MTV logo, and I thought this was very cool. I got a size medium, because it's a men's shirt, so it was very big on me. I'm usually a large. Um, this was 12 euros because it's official MTV licensing, uh, so it's a bit more expensive than your regular Primark stuff. Very excited. Then I got another official licensing thing. I got a Coca-Cola shirt. I've been wanting one for so long and I just couldn't find them. And now they have these very cute, it has a little white, I don't know if you can see it, like some white dots all over it. This was 8 euros, and I got a size large. Next up, another tie-dye thing. I promise it's the last tie-dye of today, right? Yeah, it's the last tie-dye of today, don't worry. Uh, but just this very basic pink tie-dye shirt. They had skirts with this as well, but I didn't really like them. I'm not that much of a skirt person, especially longer skirts. But I thought the tie-dye on this was just very pretty. It's a very light pink, so it's not too bright. And this was 6 euros. So that's like 
practically nothing. I also picked up this little crop top. It has this little flower detail. Don't focus on me, focus on the shirt. Yeah, there we go. Uh, this little flower detail. I love this style of top. Uh, I already had one from like two or three years ago, I think. So I picked this one up and I also got the light yellow one. I've been really liking yellow lately. I don't know what it is, but it has a little butterfly on it. It's really, um, isn't that Brandy Melville that has a very famous shirt with a butterfly like this? Either way, these were five euros a piece. I also got just some basic spaghetti strap tops. I wear these a lot when it's very hot because TMI, I sweat a lot and I don't like sweat stains on my shirt. So I wear these a lot. These were um, on sale for 180 a piece. So I got two gray ones and then this like olive -y. It's more brown on camera, but it's more green in real life. And then this mustard yellow one. I also picked up this very cute uh, pack of crew socks. And they have rainbows. And then there's like hearts. And there is more rainbows, more hearts, and then more hearts. Uh, this is five pairs of socks for 350 and then the last thing i got from primark also from the men's section is this jurassic park t-shirt i love jurassic park it's one of my favorite movie series and this is the like old old school logo i'm i'm obsessed this was seven euros moving on to the thrift store i got a few things uh, on two different trips. So today I picked up this sweater thing. It's from Shein from the Curve collection. It's an 1XL. It says movement on it. I don't know. I just really like the colors and the fit of this. It's a bit oversized, which I like. This was 150. Then I got this flannel shirt. I didn't button it up again after trying it on, but it's from the men's section. Again, couldn't care less, honestly. I like the short sleeves on this, and this was $2.75. Then I also picked up this little, it's kind of cropped sweater, and it has this like braided detail on the sides. I really liked. Again, it's more green in real life. Um, this was 350. And then also today I got this basic yellow shirt. Like I said, I love yellow lately, so picked that one up. And this was Hello? Where's the tag? Did the tag fall off? Yeah, the tech fell off on this, but it probably wasn't expensive, so sorry for that. Um, then, totally different, not from the thrift store, but I got a pair of happy socks, and they're spaghetti socks! I love spaghetti, it's one of my favorite foods, so when I saw spaghetti socks, I knew I had to have them. And then I've got two more, three more thrift things. I think. First off, this little purse, and this is actually a Primark purse, but I got it from the thrift store, so I don't know how old it is, um, but it's a very cute small little purse. I've been using it a ton. It's a great size for when I go walking or like, I don't know where, uh, but my phone fits in here, which is great, and then just some cards, things like that. Very happy with that. This was $1.95. Then I got a skirt from the thrift store. This little thing. Like I said, this is the pattern by the way. Like I said, I'm not that much of a skirt person, but I did want to give this one a try. 
This is originally from H&M. And I don't know, I tried it on and I realized how it looked. So I'm hoping I'm actually gonna wear it. If not, I'm just gonna donate it again. No big deal. And I also got this pair of paperback shorts. They're by Clockhouse. Um, so I think that's... I don't know. But they're just basic denim paperback shorts with a little strap. Love that. And then I have two more things that I ordered from H&M. I got another flannel. I love flannels, but I got a pink one and it's so soft. It's insane. It's a bit oversized. I love the fit of this. Uh, this was on sale for $7.50, I think. I've been wearing this a ton as well already, so very happy with that one. And I also picked up this little jumpsuit and this would be adorable for like a party or something. But also, I don't know, I might just wear it out on a wild day. But it's a play suit. Here we go, it's black so it's kind of hard to see. But it has a little detail here and then it's like keyhole back and it's glitter. I don't know if you can tell but... It's black glitter, but it's not insane glitter. Um, it's very, I wouldn't call it subtle, but it's okay for daily wearing. Um, this was, I don't know, they don't have the prices on the tags, and I honestly don't remember. But for the two things together, it was like 18 euros, I think. So they were both on sale. And that was all the clothing that I got today. Like, not today, but I have to show today. So, yeah. That didn't make any sense. Either way, thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video, and I'll see you next time. Bye!